Hi guys! Um, what I wanted to talk about right now is a very recent acquisition um, and it is something that I hankered after a while and then when it arrived I thought oh don't know whether it's for me and it's the Mulberry um, Delray regular size and I absolutely love the colour, love the leather Love the style, and the reason why I was thinking, oh, I'm not sure whether it's for me, it's just because I didn't realise it was this big. Now, I had until recently a small Delray, and actually I still have it here. It isn't mine anymore. I have sold it to somebody, so just for quick comparison, we're not playing with it, just to show you. This is the small one, and it comes with a crossbody strap as well. This is one in oak, and this one is the regular one. And whereas this one is actually holds quite a lot and is probably a lovely little sort of day bag, this one I I um, get out of the box and immediately thought, oh my god, that's like a weekender or something like that. And then I thought, you know what, let's give that a go. So we're going to put the little one away because as I said, it's not mine anymore. Make sure she's safe somewhere. Um, And that's what we're going to do now. So we're going to... Before we do that though, I'll just quickly give you the measurements. So, length of the bag over the width is about 34 centimeters and she is 24 centimeters high and that's 16 centimeters deep. So there. So anyway, so what I was thinking is, yes, let's do the whole kind of, um, we are going away for the weekend, let's see whether if we pack really, really lightly, um, we can do that with a regular Delray. Just let me adjust the screen a little bit. Don't have time to reshoot this today, so we're doing this all on the fly. Um, so there we go. So my scenario is, my other half, uh, myself and our little one, uh, we're in Germany. Um, and uh, we can leave our little one with my parents and we'll just um, fly off to Florence because I get to pick and so I get I pick Florence um, and uh, it's nice and warm so I don't have to bring too many clothes and we'll just do a little bit of sightseeing, a little bit of food and, and what you do when you go to a nice little city little city? when you go to nice uh, on, on a city break somewhere, right? okay so, what do I have to take? Um, got a few things here. So, because we're staying overnight, I'm just going to take a t-shirt um, to sleep in, a couple of pairs of fresh knickers, and a bra. Now, we're going to fly down, and I'm just going to wear um, my jeans, and probably pretty much what I'm wearing right now, and maybe take a light jacket or something like that. Um, so essentially I have a pair of jeans with me, so I'm cheating a little bit. Um, so I've got something to sleep in, I've got a fresh pair of underwear, a couple of pairs of knickers and, and another set of fresh underwear. Um, so on the first evening we're going to go for something to eat. So I will probably wear just a little skirt, this little jersey skirt from All Saints, I think, and I like it because you can roll it up and it doesn't really crease very much. And because it's nice and warm, I'm just going to wear a little strappy top. That's just the vest top from um, Next. And then because I always get cold, I'm going to wear over it a pink cropped cardigan, um, which is from Bowden. And they're really nice because they are... Uh, cashmere blend so even though they're small um, they keep you nice and warm and because I'm flying down in my jeans on Converse I'm just gonna pair uh, bring a pair of sort of ballerinas and so I don't have to put don't like putting shoes in bags go put them in a little in a little Bowden bag so that's in there um, and then the day after I will depending on how warm it is I might either wear that skirt um, with another t-shirt I'm going to take or if it's cooler I will wear um, the jeans with the t-shirt and I'm just taking another a little black cardigan again same it's the, it's the cropped cashmere cardigan for bone and then that evening on Saturday evening we're going out for something nice to eat and I'm going to wear my black 
Vivian Westwood Anglomania jersey dress. Again, great because jersey and it doesn't really wrinkle, you just sort of roll it all up. And there we go. So I think that's pretty much clothing taken care of. Only other thing I'm going to take is just um, like a scarf wrap type thing. So you can either add it as another uh, layer on in the evening or when you're flying or as a scarf or as a touch of colour. So I'm cheating a little bit because we're all in black and we just have really the, the, the pink, <coughs> excuse me, I've got a bit of a cold, the pink cardigan um, and the purple um, scarf. Um, but it's just easier that way, obviously, when you're going away. So we're going to try and pop all of those things in there. So underwear and night t-shirt and the other spare t-shirt. Then we've got the Vivian Westwood dress. The skirt. The vest top. Cardigan number one. Cardigan number two. Scarf, shoes, there we go. Um, now, because we're just going away for a couple of days, obviously I'm not going to take loads of toiletries. I assume I will be um, going into a really nice hotel and they have all of the nice shower gels and stuff. So I'm just taking my usual flight essentials and just some facial care, like a moisturizer, something to take off my makeup, that kind of stuff. Well, now we're, we're getting a bit squeezy. Um, but what I did think is because this is sort of my carry-on luggage. Now I'm cheating again a little bit, but because I won't want to carry this around with my sightseeing, I'm also taking this, which is my mini Alexa. So therefore, my mini Lexi can just take care, hopefully, of the other essentials. So she can take my purse, my passport. Phone. There's my phone. Um, what else have I got? Some tissues. My inhaler. Um, do I need to take a shopping bag? We'll see whether I'll put that in there. Now, my makeup bag is actually um, quite full, and in all honesty, all I use out of that is probably a couple of things, which is mascara um, and uh, eyelash curlers. A brush for my eyebrows uh, and then maybe some one of those BB kind of creams. Um, I'm also taking a couple of necklaces um, and I was going to stick them in here but I don't really have anything else to put in here. Pop this in one side. One statement necklace. Look at this cute! It's like a little little Bambi. Um, put this in the other side together with my mobile phone charger cable and this can go on the side in the Delray. Yeah, close the zips. Oh, that's good. Uh, I'm going to take my diary just in case because I can also take some notes in there deodorant and actually this is just the hanger don't need that don't need that you know what i'm going to be controversial i'll leave my blackberry at home um and that's it so actually let's close it up carefully now i could probably repack this a little bit more considerately um because I've never, as I said, I've never, um, I haven't tried this before. <coughs> so I haven't thought about what to put in the bottom and whatever. Um, and I didn't have time. I have to go and pick up my little one in a minute. Um, I didn't have time for a dry run or anything. So we've got a tiny little bag with my essentials, including my passport. And then as my carry-on luggage, I've got my regular size Delray 
Well, no, I think I'm just about ready now to um, fly to Florence um, and have some nice Italian food. And um, yeah, on that note, I shall be daydreaming and um, hope you found this useful. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you again. Let me know what you think. Bye.